In today's video, we're gonna take you step by step on how to build a little mini pond. So in today's video, we're gonna be putting this little mini koi pond into our front garden in front of our house, right by the big bay window. Mm -hmm. And this is a 40 gallon pre-molded little pond. And we're, we just have to find the perfect spot over here so we can see it from our big window. You can see here, all we need to do is dig out enough space for this here and we have to figure out the perfect spot right here so we can view it from the bay window all right that's about the spot where it's going to go and i cleared all the plants away so i'm going to dig my hole right here all right here is our hole that we dug and then we put the little pond in there i put some dirt up around the edges and then samuel's over here rinsing out some rocks that are going to go inside it right Shug? little hose action there and then I got a couple extra bags I'm gonna put around the edge but first I'm gonna transplant these uh, a still be around the pond that I dug up to make room for it and over here watching here's granny and Franklin snacking we put some still bees around the edges here and mm -hmm. put some rocks in and we're using the extra to put around the edges and we're gonna get some plants from the backyard to put around here more. Yep, there's put the rocks around the edge. Yep. Got a couple more bags of rocks to put in. Let's go in the backyard and look for some more plants to put around the front, okay? Okay. Here we are so far. We've got some more rocks around here and some transplanted things around it. So from the street, you're not gonna see it, but from the window you will. And then Samuel's bringing a couple toad houses up here. We're still sprinkling some rocks around, but in the wheelbarrow, we got some big decorative rocks. That snail statue, we'll put those around. I'll give you an update after that. Okay, we just moved the water, the bird bath over here, and Samuel's filling that up. And then here's what we've got so far. A couple toad houses in there. A bunch of decorative rocks, a lot of plants. Looking good, Samuel. Mm -hmm. We just need to put that birdhouse back in. Yep. All right, now we just added the filter, and what it is, it's a laundry bag with sponges in it, and I took that out of our big giant koi pond in the back, and I'll just put this rock on it, and I'm gonna have the water come down here and go through the filter into the pond. And then, what do you got there, Samuel? And I found a toad. In the backyard, look at that. Mm -hmm. And then what do you got there, Sam? We have a 1943 a Mercury Dime. How did we get that? Found it in the dirt. While we are digging? Mm -hmm. Nice. Then... Here's Samuel coming around the corner with some pond water out of our koi pond in the backyard. It's got all the beneficial bacteria in it. It'll be healthy for the baby koi that are going to be going in it. All right, so now the water pump is in the deep end, and then it goes around here, and it's going through that, and it's pouring right there, and it's gonna be blowing water right through our sponge filters. That'll be filled up with beneficial bacteria, and then I'll just take that rock and pick it up, and I'll just take that bag of sponges out, and I'll wring that out maybe once a month or so. So now I have a bubbler over here. I'm just gonna plug that in and put that in next. Okay, there's the bubbler. So you've got nice water movement and good flow. And a nice filter. And all of this water came out of our pond in the backyard. I'll show you a clip of that right now. So right now, this is where we have our baby koi. You see, I have some in the net. Uh-huh. And... They're one month old yeah. today. And we're, we're going to take gonna... Uh, the, all the baby koi out of there and these some of these pond plants. So we're going to transplant those into the little pond in the front. Check out our koi pond in the backyard here. With all our big koi. Lots of koi fish in there. Alright, here is our one month old baby koi fish. They're one month old today. We have a variety of different colors and patterns. What I'm going to 
do is let them go now in the new pond. In their new home. They're just gonna love this. Okay. You see here we got a few pond plants from the back. That'll give it some more shade in the morning and that'll help with uh, filtering the pond out some more. Okay. I'm gonna release a toad so he knows this is gonna be a happy little place for him here. Maybe you'll find the toad homes and hang out in there. Yeah. Okay, one last step. I just transplanted some marigolds, some flowers in around the little pond. Boy, does that look nice. That's gonna be so much fun to look at from the bay window. Okay, here is the final result from inside the living room looking out the big bay window. Look at that awesome little koi pond. The flowers out there, that is nice. What do you think, boys? It's really Pretty cool. cool. Awesome. Twin Cities Adventures, out.